Thank Cheers, you. everyone. Yeah. Yay. Yeah. Cheers. 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 Yeah. Cheers. 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 Yeah, I, the, the, the wine they just served is the Ferrari di San Valomelli. <clears throat> so it's a, it's a wine that uh, I'm proud to present because also it brings uh, the name of my family, the Lunelli name. It is again a Trento Doc, which means, you know, bottle fermented sparkling wine. We are back to the Chardonnay. Again, Chardonnay from Trentino. And this is a Chardonnay that we cultivate in the area of Margon, which is uh, a very important vineyard for us it's, it, because it's around the Villa Margon a 16th century uh, villa that uh, belongs to my family. Uh, this Ferrari San Valomelli has a very distinctive character because it's the only Ferrari that makes the first fermentation in wood. So you can probably perceive, uh, you know, both in the nose and in the mouth, the richness in taste, which is really coming from the first fermentation in wood. We did a lot of experiment on how to use wood fermentation. And at the end, we decided that the best for us was really to use 40 hectometers large barrels from Austrian oak. So there is an Austrian producer of barrels that work with us called Stockinger, and we do the first fermentation with these large oak barrels. And this, this is you know, how we make a Ferrari Serval Melli, which is a Blanc de Blanc, a Trento Doc, but with this very unique character. It's uh, compared to the Ferrari Brut or Ferrari Perlet, which is about harmony and freshness. Here we have this uh, richness and this uh, nice structure that makes this Ferrari di Salvarnelli a perfect restaurant wine. So it, to me, it's more, it's really a wine that has to be uh, tasted with food. Yeah. Yeah. We put on each bottle the disgorgement date. That's very important so that, uh, you know, looking especially for vintage product, you know that this is a 2006 vintage of Ferrari di Salvarunelli. It has been disgorged in 2015, which means that between 2007, the spring after the harvest, up, uh, you know, until the 2015, this wine has been aging on the list. Uh, Abalone, is a, actually it's a New Zealand green Abalone, which is marinated. Previously it has been cooked uh, as confit, so it has been cooked 18 hours, 80 degrees. Then it's marinated with extra virgin olive oil, and on the top we have the Italian experience. Tomato and bell pepper compote with the Calvisis Elite Caviar from uh, Lombardy. Oh, wow. Well, uh, to mm -hmm. enjoy together with this uh, great uh, Perle, 2000, Perle Rosé 2008 would be memorable for you, for your all, the, all senses, okay? Okay. <laughs> so this is an Italian caviar. That's Okay, keep enjoying. So cheers, everyone. Cheers. 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 Get up and do the thing, all. Cheers. Salute. 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 Salute.